Welcome to Santa Live. I wanted to give a quick tutorial to show you how to use the app. First screen you come to, you have to go down and choose which Santa scene you want. There's going to be up to 15. You just tap on the Santas below. It'll walk through. You'll hear what the Santa has to say. And then once you pick it, uh, you get to the AR screen where we have to now measure the floor to make sure that the Santa, when he's inserted, is going to be level on the floor. Just keep moving it around until you see the dots. That means that it's recognized a flat surface. Now, here's your preview of the Santa, and you get to practice making them bigger, smaller. Um, you can see on the right-hand side, there's a mirror button, which switch sides. You want them coming in from the left or the right. There's also a brightness button right below that, so if your scene's a little bit darker, you can make Santa a little bit darker to fit into that. Then if you misplace Santa, you can hit the reposition. It'll put him back. Oh. Now, hold the camera as steady as possible. Let's start playing around with Santa. Make sure he's the right size. Uh, the, I have a seven and a half foot Christmas tree oh. there, so I'm using that kind of to measure to see how big Santa would be. You can also place um, another person in the screen to see how tall they are to, to see if Santa's the right size. Oh. You don't want to have a Santa too big, you don't want to have one too small. Turn that thing Keep moving around. You can actually walk closer to the Santa if you want to pretend like you're walking up on him, or you can oh. zoom away. This particular clip, um, we're going to record. Um, has a little bit of the top and bottom cut off as he approaches the camera, so you have to be a little oh. bit closer to him. We have him in perfect position now. We're recording. Again, hold the camera as steady as possible. Uh, he is talking to the camera, oh. telling you to turn it off. He, he didn't want to get caught. Now, uh, you can check your scene, make sure it looks good. If it does, or even if it doesn't, now we give you an editing screen. Now we get into the video editor where you can uh, clean up your video if you made a couple of mistakes. Uh, if your video is too long, too short, um, you can actually go and trim it. So you touch the horizontal lines and pull it toward, if you're at the end, you can shorten the video. Or if you want to take the, um, the front of the video down a little bit so you just have the Santa come in, you can do that as well. Oh. Next, what I like to do, um, sometimes the feet on a white or light floor make him look like he's floating. You can go to the custom crop button and then you can kind of crop his feet out so you don't see that. It looks way more realistic uh, to me anyway. Um, still a little bit more feet than I want, so I'm going to go shorten up the video a little bit more. And now it looks perfect. Then after that's done, hit the save, and then um, since Santa normally comes at night, I like to go change the brightness. Oh. Tap on the brightness button. You can use the slider bar to make it a little bit darker to match the scene at night. Uh, it, it will darken both Santa and the scene, so play around with it until it looks perfect to you. And then hit the checkbox in the lower right to save it. And then one other feature we have that you Turn that it's thing off. purely a preference. You can go in and make the Santa blurry as well. So the tree in the background is blurry. You can make Santa blurry so it looks like the camera was out of focus. I personally like having Santa in front of the tree as if there's a field of depth look with the camera. Save it. It'll save it to your phone on your device and your photos and then share it with your kids. Merry Christmas.